look who tore himself away from himself long enough to join us. Yeah, usually he's too busy for lunch. All right, both of you stop. Honey, you washed your hands, right? Hey, Dad, I can't believe I'm going to say this, but... Can I talk to you in private for a moment? No, I don't think so. I know the kind of things you do in private. Dad. Oh, all right. Just keep your hands where I can see them. <laughs> this really isn't getting old. <clears throat> okay. So, you know how I do things that are horrible, and it seems like I can't make them any worse? <laughs> and then I do? Sadly, yes. Well... I did it again. Again? How many bathrooms does that house have? No. Not... Not that. Uh, Dada wanted to talk about the horrible thing. Oh. They always want to talk about it. Yeah, well, we talked about it. And in the course of talking about it, information was revealed that made it much much worse and that is why you never ever talk about it have you ever noticed how often i just grunt at your mother i know how to talk i'm not an ape right. i just choose not to right well it's too late for that now since you screwed up and talked about it there's only one thing to do Go on the offensive. Counterattack. What? That's suicide, man. They'll never expect it. It throws them off. You know, one time in Korea, we had this little guy outnumbered 20 to 1. But then he ran at us, screaming his head off. And we were so taken off guard that we dove right into our foxholes. And he got away? No, no. No, I mean, we were startled for a few seconds. But then the whole company just opened up on it. Listen up, Donna. I got something to say. Okay, but be careful. Jackie's mom was here earlier. I don't want you to catch a whiff of her perfume and have to sexually assault yourself in the hallway. No, 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 no. I talk, you listen. Okay, this is all your fault. Yeah, do you have any idea what your celibacy thing is doing to me? My needs have risen to near... Fezian levels. He is a sick bastard, Donna, and now, thanks to you, so am I. Yeah, that's right, Donna. You created a monster. I can't leave myself alone. You know what? You're right. I'm sorry. You are? I mean, I'm... Yeah, damn right you are. No, this has been really hard. And the celibacy thing was my idea, so... I need to accept some responsibility for the odd and disgusting things you do. That's right, you do. But, you know, next time, be like a normal person. Go to your room, lock the door, light some candles, put on some Al Green, and make an evening of it. Wow, Donna, that was really detailed. <laughs> it's almost like... Oh, my God. You do it, too. What? No, no. I'd notice the candles getting lower, even though I'd never seen them lit. All right, this conversation is over. Wow. So this is where it all happens. Do they make an evening of it? Yeah. Candles, music. God, girls do everything better. I don't suppose Jackie. Nah, she wouldn't even go to a self-serve gas station. What would happen if I walked in during one of their evenings? Are they like us, where even though we're alone, we welcome a visitor? Well, yeah, I mean, it's not like they'd rather do it themselves and think of a man do it, right? Right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>